Hello, my name is Cyrus Sutton. Just a quick little FYI, I will probably stutter during this, so please bear with me. Anyways, I'm in group 13 and we have standard 6, so just to give a quick little summary about standard 6, uh, physical therapist assistants shall enhance their competence through the lifelong acquisition and refinement of knowledge, skills, and abilities. Basically meaning you should all, shall achieve and maintain cl clinical competence and you should always be like eager and engaged to learn in lifelong lessons and you should always like be on your toes especially because like uh, a role of physical therapist or a responsibility or like basically advances in the practice we're, we're, we're are probably going to change in the future. I don't know, don't know about the near future but will probably change in the future. Um, and basically like when a physical therapist you should always be eager to learn and absorb any new knowledge that you didn't have pre-existing before you should always be you know eager to learn and be on your toes and i guess like one thing that always stuck with me is just like when i hurt my back uh, my physical therapist told me it's just motion is lotion and so and she said this it, could, it can apply to any injury like just motion it doesn't have to be like a super difficult motion but she basically told me it's just like walking around the park motion is lotion and it will help you slowly it will help the injury slowly get better and better to the point where it could even possibly be stronger than it was before the injury happened but yeah, that's pretty much all for standard six. And for standard eight, physical therapist assistants shall participate in efforts to meet the health needs of people locally, nationally, or globally. And this is basically like as a physical therapist, especially in this assistant, you should uh, be eager and like, you should like help anyone that is in need. Like if you're not like where you are, let's say you're traveling, you should always be eager and like, be I guess like one of the first responders to help someone if an accident happens that you just so happen to witness to see happen sorry if that made sense but at least me and my group we should it's basically it's just like you should always meet and attend to people's needs that are basically in need and it's just yeah especially for people who can't help themselves that yeah so yeah thank you for your time <laughs>